In this episode in the Climate Change series, we're going to take a look at one of the main contributors to global warming and what you can do to minimise its effect. The burning of fossil fuels. Fossil fuels like coal, oil and natural gas have been humanity's primary energy source for over a century. When burned, these fuels release energy, which we use in many ways for powering our homes. This encompasses everything from lighting to heating and cooling systems and all the appliances in between. The use in vehicles, fueling cars, trucks, buses and other modes of transportation. And in factories, providing the necessary energy for manufacturing, assembly lines and other industrial processes. By harnessing this energy, we've propelled societies forward, but not without environmental consequences. Burning fossil fuels emits carbon dioxide and other greenhouse gases into the atmosphere. These gases trap heat from the sun, amplifying the planet's natural warming effect, leading to what we commonly refer to as our carbon footprint. You can revise the effect of greenhouse gases on global warming and climate change in previous episodes in this climate change series. The carbon dioxide released when fossil fuels are burned doesn't vanish into thin air. Instead, it lingers in our atmosphere for years, in fact decades, continually trapping heat. The higher the concentration of these gases, the hotter our planet gets, setting off a domino effect of climate disturbances, from melting polar ice to extreme weather events. Now, more than ever, reducing our carbon footprint is vital in our fight against climate change. Initiating the change can be as basic as being mindful of our energy consumption. Simple gestures like turning off unused lights, opting for energy efficient appliances or using public transport can make a difference. Another promising avenue is the rise of electric cars and other electric vehicles. Unlike traditional gasoline powered vehicles, electric vehicles produce no tailpipe emissions. This means that not only do they contribute to reducing our carbon footprint, but they also help keep the air cleaner and healthier to breathe. When these electric vehicles are charged using renewable energy sources, their environmental benefits are further amplified, offering a dual advantage of cleaner air and a reduced greenhouse gas impact. Choosing and pushing for clean energy options like solar and wind energy helps because they don't release the bad gases that hurt our planet. Choosing these energy sources is a big step to a cleaner future. Personal choices, such as using public transport or electric vehicles, embracing energy-saving technologies or supporting eco-conscious businesses can all chip away at our carbon emissions. Every step, no matter how small, is a leap towards a brighter, sustainable future for all. Don't forget to subscribe!